No, what happened to your eye? It looks terrible. Oh, anyway, here's my figurines, all covered in dust. Dirty now. Haven't cleaned it in like four years, five years. Ever since I started YouTube, or I had these up before YouTube, I started doing it. Anyway, I'm not talking about my figurines, I'm talking about my video games, my video game collection. And first up, pretty much, I'm gonna show you my Steam collection. So let's just zoom right into this. Alright, so here's my Steam collection, starting off with my Steam collection, pretty much. So we got Akka Strip, pretty much this is my third copy of the game. I got it on the PS3 and the Vita. And as you can see, I recently bought this game. Moving on, don't really know. Audio Surf, kind of good game. Access and Allies. Then we got Battlefield games, Battlefield 4 as well, Battlefield 1 and 4. Battle Shock, Blood and Bacon, Borderlands 2, then we got Call of Duties, more Call of Duties. This one here, I bought it so long a time ago, and I haven't played it. So yeah, this is back when before anime games were on Steam. This one and another two was on Steam and I just bought it because it was anime at the time. And back then it was none of those stuff. We got cluster strikes, we got um, virtual novels, we got counter strike, died alive, haven't played it or read it. It's pretty much a virtual novel. Can we say it's a game? Then we got Daisy Um it's X what do you call that one? Dead Owens, Dead Realm, Deadpool, I got Deadpool, that's good. Devil May Cry, Doom, Duke Nukem. Dungeon Escape, then we got Elder Scrolls, Oblivion, Regen, Skyrim. That one's probably a dead game now. We got Expender Bros, Fallout 4, Fear 2. Yep, and this is another one, very long time ago, before anime started coming out on Steam. This is one of the three games that was on Steam at the time. Bought it. We got Gary's Mod. Genshin um, Impact, Goat Simulator, and more. Half-Life, what a Half-Life. Yep, pretty much when I started Steam, I got, the reason why I got Steam was for so I can play Half-Life. Alright, Hand Simulator, Heavy Weapon, and more virtual novels, Wrath of Dead. Oh, here's a good one. These, these games here, the Resident of Heroes, got great story to it. I do have some of them on the PlayStation. So yeah, we got Zero, the Sky Games, and Azure. The Cold Steel I got it on the PlayStation. We got another Doom game, Minecraft, Virtual Novels again, or up JRPGs. Then we got a lot of Neko's, No Man's Sky, No Time to Explain, Overlord. Yeah, PlayStation Emulators, Poly Bridge, and here's another one. That was on Steam a long time ago, and I decided to buy. So yeah, a lot of these games I haven't played. We got Resident Evil 2 demo, Resident Evil 1, played it, finished it. Haven't played Zero yet, but played the demo of number two, but that's about it. Um, yeah, bike game, Lost, more virtual novel, we got Star Wars, Shadow Warriors, 1, 2, yep, 1 and 2. We got Stick Fight, that's a good um, game to mess around. More Team Fortress, Toko Xanadu. I haven't played that game. It did say I only went on there for a bit, a few bit minutes or so, you could say. But I haven't played it. Battlegrounds, yep, you know, card game. And we got Wreckfest, that's good. Wolfenstein, um, haven't played. And yeah. In the way all the rest is one of the greatest games of well, Yeez. As you can see, I got all the Yeez games on Steam besides one. That's Yeez 9, and I got that on the PlayStation. Once I earn a bit more money, then I would probably get it on Steam. So yeah, that's all my Steam games. Half of it, probably. I got some hidden games in my hidden sections. But you think we pretty not much know why those are in hidden areas. Let's move on, and let's not talk about those ones. Alright, let's start from the back. I'll be moving these drawers back and forth just to show you in order. So some from my PlayStation 1, very dark. 
reason why I don't have much PlayStation 1 here is because my house got broken into, a lot of games got stolen. Before that, I sold a heap to a PlayStation 1 game, so yeah. I wasn't really correcting or looking after my PlayStation 1 games back when I was a kid. So yeah, this is actually the only the original one I had ref, in, as you can see. I wasn't looking after it, I uh, break the whole game out of the case and put it in a different case. Yeah, kind of stupid if you ask me. But yeah, that's that. So anyway, moving on. We got Digimon World, Die Hard, pretty good. We got two Japanese games and that's these are the Atelier games. I'm very into. It's good. So yeah, I got one and two. There we go. I already showed you my Digimon World 2003. I played this game to death when I was a kid and I have no idea what I was doing half of the time. We got pretty much Doc Hack for the PS2. There we go. Like that cover. Oh yeah, we got one, two, four. I only played up the first three and never continued it. I really need to finish it. These ones actually came with the DVDs, so the anime came with it. Then we got into the another Atria games. My first at 3 game is actually the number 3, this one here. That was my first at 3 game. That's number 2. Yep, moving on, we got Persona 4. Yep, I actually played Persona 4 on the PlayStation 2 and not the Vita. Or the PC. Then we got Digimon and Dead or Alive 2. Moving this across. And we got more games, PlayStation 2 games. We got Star Ocean. Or Far in there, we got Dragon Ball Z, Budokai 123, Tai Chi 123, and I believe this one here is Final Fantasy game. Yes, it's a Final Fantasy game. Then we got 10, 10 2, Half Life, yeah, another Half Life game, Die Hard game. Then we got Masha Full Loaded, this is like a yeah, that one. Let's put that back. Then we got one of the old military games. What do you call it? Um, Medal of Honor. Yeah. Rising Sun. That's actually a good game. Sync Campaign. Very good one. Then we got Need for Speed Most Wanted. Um, 10, 13. And we got more Need for Speed. Kill Zone and Black. Alright, that's the first top rows. Moving downwards, we got the PSP games down here. Once again, Killzone again, Murder Slug, Manakumi, that's another Atria game. So there we go, good one. And a Trails game, Trails in the Sky, they're for the PSP. Yep, once again, the Trails series, or the version of Heroes, got very good story lines to it. So, really recommend you do play that game if you're into JRPGs. Moving on we got Tales games with Tales in the World then the third one and Turn in here I think that's how you pronounce it. Yeah that one there. Then we got Sky Ocean 1 and 2. Alright then we're moving on to the PlayStation 3 games and this one I'm gonna have heat of. So we've got Star Wars, Mirror's Edge, more kill zones and here comes the Call of Duty games, all of them. And at the far end, we got a Battlefield game. And I believe the only Battlefield games are Bad Company. Yeah, pretty much Bad Company is only the one that's got the good story one to it. So other than that, Bad Company campaigns all sucks in Battlefield games. Besides the Bad Company ones, they actually got good story to it. Right, moving on. There we go. At the far end, once again, Bad Company 2, then we got Battlefield 3, Fallout 3, Fallout New Vegas, God of War, Uncharted. Well, not looking at my phone, I've been tilting it up again. So, yeah, what a game. PlayStation All Stars, Pilot in the Caribbean, Logo, Portal 2, Borderlands, Duke Nukem, oh, yeah, what a game. Doom, Fear 3, and Bioshock. Alright. Now, moving down to my third, let's get off the chair first, third row, third row, yeah, we got Grand Theft Auto, 5, Tekken, Dead or Alive, 5, yeah, two of those, 
Ninja Guidance, one, two, three, two threes. Then we got the spin off of Ninja Guidance Robot Chainsaw, Dragon Ball Z, Persona 4, and all the other ones. I also got Bleach Day, Dynasty Warriors, and Naruto. Heaps of Naruto games. Can't forget about the Naruto games. Just moving on, then we got Station, once again, at the corner. This one, 3 4. And what other weird games? Then we got Arrows Turmoil. I don't know how to pronounce that, but yeah. Another Atari game, Atari Warona and Warona Plus. It's got rated R, which is so weird. It's exactly the same game that's right next to it. They got Toll Tree, Memboo. Yeah, all the Atari games, as you can see. I've got all heaps. And once again, this game again. So I actually played that one on the PlayStation and I decided to buy it on a PC just in case. Then we got Natumnia and then we're moving down to the bottom row after that. Ah, here we go, on the bottom. We got Resident of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel. Once again, great series, great storyline. It's connected to the Sky games. Moving on, we got Tales of Grace. So, so funny. Yeah, pretty much all the Tales games here. Then we go on to the Vita games. And as you can see, I have tons of Vita. Once again, Ninja Gardens, Dead or Alive, Persona, Disquire, and Samurai Kagura. That's the Japanese one there. Then we got um, Hachimuku, another Japanese one. And some other one. Then we got Heat Up, as I mentioned. Tons of them, if you can ask me. Then we at the corner we got Galaxy Rush and more Atria game. As you guys can see it, too dark probably for you guys. But yeah, at the last one it's Aquarius Drip. I have like three copies of those. And we got the 3DS games. Only three of them here, since I already played them all. So yep, Saiyan Kagura Burst and Saiyan Kagura 2. Then the last one is Last of Us. Alright, now moving on to the front doors, where the PlayStation 4 games are at. Alright, now this is much brighter, we can see, and I'm sitting on the chair again. At 3 games, as you can see, yep, we got 6 at 3 games here. And once again, we got Trials of Cold Steel 1, 2, and 3 and 4 this time. So yeah, these are good Resident Evil Heroes games, Hyper Dimension again. And another more Tales games. So you pretty much can tell which type of games I'm into. Anime type RPGs. Then we got Digimon. What more Digimon? Sangha Kawa again. Burst in New. Then we got the beach one. Where they're all on the beach. That one. Then one with the water guns. And here's a good one. Yeez 9. That's a very good game. Then we got Blue Reflection. There's an anime of that came out recently. Probably should give that one a try. I'm missing like two episodes now. And you need to watch those. And moving on, we got Sky Ocean, Dragon Ball Z again. Fist of the North Star, that's good. This one here, one with the no name on the side, that's Naruto. Then we got Nier, Automata, and Final Fantasy VII. Moving downwards again. We got that game I can't pronounce. Ghost of Tsushima, Rubenstein, or what do you call it? Yeah, that one. We got Spider Man, The Last of Us, we've mastered. Tomb Raider 1 and 2, Crash Bandicoot, another Grand Theft game, Kill Zone, and Battlefield 4. Once again, I have Battlefield 4 on Steam. And we got PlayStation VR, yep, I have VR. And Destiny and Uncharted 4. On the bottom, there's only these three, Bloodborne, The Crew, and Master of Maf Mafia 3. Can't even pronounce that one. How terrible. Alright, now onto the containers. So these ones I pretty much played. All these are just cards. We got more PlayStation 1 games. These were my brothers, but he just gave it to me. So we got Clock, I'm Destruction Derby, Crash Bandicoot 1, 2, and 3. Oh, yeah. Team Racing. We got Die Hard 2 and Grand Theft Auto. Down here, we got more Yeez game again, another Yeez, Call of Duty, Pokemon, 
and a monster hunter and some other ones more crash bandicoot and gun photo we got tiny hawk and worms that's good and hatsumuku i believe that's english or yeah that's that's the english version and that's my feet all right moving on those sections are pretty much played yeah bedroom's a mess that's it those ones are played now moving on to here don't want to press any buttons on my phone we got duke nukem time to kill and my recent game so nexus so you pretty much can tell all this here i haven't played so let's move these off to the side and let's see it from the top the bottom so we got Red Dead Redemption, 1, 2, we're going to have a VR game, Dark Souls, I actually do like Dark Souls, well, I like Bloodborne, Dark Souls I haven't really played. Alright, we got Final Fantasy, Metal Gear Solid, more Solid, Metal Gear Solid, Steins Gate, once again, I haven't played, or oh, we got Reddit, it's a virtual novel, we got some other games, more Final Fantasy game, Naruto game. Blue, Blaze Blue, a fighting game. Then we got Persona. And yeah, a lot of games here I haven't played. This one here, I've been meaning to play it, but I keep on putting it off. Oh well, that's that. I got those games. Alright, moving up to more of them. We got God Eater 2. Knights of Azure 1 and 2, Sword Art Command. Heaps of Sword Art Commands, you can say. I pretty much got almost all of them, besides the recent ones. Then we got Dynasty Warriors, and yeah. More Fun and Fancy. Oh, what's this game? It's empty. Can't see. Ah, it's Croc 2. Goody. So yeah, we got Croc 2, Rayman 2, Pac-Man World, Duke Nukem. That's pretty good. Alright, now we're going to the video games. Well, some video games. Persona Dancing. And yeah, that's what we'll get it. Freedom Wars. Kill Zone again. And over here we got Code Vein, Spyro. We got Farpoint. And Doc Hack. That's the other ones I haven't played. Pretty much terrible at going back on my games. I you really need to start playing my games again. Yeah, yeah. And here's another ad to your game. At the corner, this one here. It's like a spin off with all the other characters in it. That's kind of a good thing. I got that. And we got more 3DS games. We got Hatamuku again, Tales of Abyss. The only Tales game I haven't played. Then we got Pokemon, Persona again, and Rayman. And this one is Fun and Fancy, I believe. Yep. There we go. That's Fun and Fancy. Alright, I believe that's all of them. Here's my little collections, as you can see here. Good old nice things. And the back looks all nice, but when you get up close, you can see all the dust on them. Yeah, they're real filthy. If you walk closer, you can see no other with one eye. That's terrible. Anyway guys, that's about it for all my videos. That's all my game collection. It's pretty much all my game collection. I got some installed on my PlayStation and all that. But yeah. Pretty much that's all I can show you. I do have another container full of PC games, but I already showed you like 90% of them on Steam already. It's like two or three in there. It's not on Steam. Can't be bothered showing you those. They're not very good games. They're terrible games. Anyway, guys, like the video. Leave a comment down below. Subscribe to this channel. And I'll see you all in my next video.